Hello everyone, I am Pyro Falcon and this is Monster Rancher. In the last episode, Bum Bum got to the S class beyond all expectations and Holly immediately gave us the retirement warning. And then Bum Bum turned five years old and Holly gave us another retirement warning. So here is what we're doing. September week four, we are gonna try the official S class tournament. Win or lose, Bum Bum will be retired at that point. So, hopefully we get there. Let's do this. Uh, there's not really a lot we can do with her numbers. Her skill is the closest. I don't have enough money to go on training, so we'll just keep doing hunting, at least for now, and then we'll see how she does in the S class. I'm worried about it. I don't think she's gonna survive there, but what other choice do I have, you know? I mean, I gotta do something. I'm going to kind of take it easy on her for the next little bit here. Uh, well, I don't want to take it too easy on her. The game does get upset when I... Nah, we'll do two and then rest. Even if that, even if that's a bit easy on Bum Bum, I don't want to be in a position where I work her so much she just straight up dies. So, let's, uh, let's not do that. And she's earning her keep, so we're fine. Keep doing your hunting. September week four is my birthday in real life, since my birthday is September 22nd, so... Maybe for my birthday present, we're gonna beat the S class. That's not the end of the game, is it? Or is it? Does Monster Rancher 1 have, like, the big four tournaments and then an Ultra Mega Super tournament? Or... Is the, is the official S-Class tournament just it? Can we actually beat the game on this episode? Surely not. Surely not. I didn't look up any FAQs for the game, so... Yeah, okay, we'll work you three times. Um... I'll have to do that. I'll, I'll, I, I need to do that anyway when we do some pausing and moving around when I make a new monster. So um, I'll be able to kind of see what's going on at that point. Okay. Hi. How are you? Thank you. Reduce training fees. Oh, that's tempting. But now we're in the month, so I can't do it because I don't want to miss the next tournament. She probably has a little bit longer to go if the tests we ran with Darth Naga are accurate. But I don't want to risk her because I I really don't want to save Scum. I know how much you guys hate that. And I, I do just want to legit beat uh, Monster Rancher 1, so... You know. Bum Bum seems tired. Yep, that's... That's expected. Okay. Oh, man. Here comes the big test. Yeah, Bum Bum's in good shape. Or at least she's not gonna get any better. All right, Bum Bum, this is the last thing we're gonna ask of you. I promise, win or lose, we're gonna we're gonna retire you after this tournament. And if if we don't win, then whatever. Um, you know, we'll we'll have good breeding stock. Ladies and gentlemen, the battle will now begin. Are not. Arngra is against us. That's not that's not promising. The the first thing we're against is a hair. Is that a hair gel? Or a hair dragon? Is the only gel we fought is red, so I wondered what his subtype is. Yeah, it's oh that's a pixie. That's a hair pixie. Ugh. Alright. Um Those aren't overly intimidating numbers. He's got some power, but our dodge rate should be able to help his help against his accuracy. Oh jeez. Oh, flame was highlighted. Okay, psychic so kick. All right, we're we're not screwed yet. 80% chance on shock. That's really good. Yeah, go ahead and get all your moves out there, buddy. Okay, so now Get away from me. Shock him. Wow, he dodged an 84% chance. 
All right, I, I want to try another one. I almost got farted on by a rabbit. All right, psychic kick. Eh, not bad, but that I don't think that's going to be enough to carry us to victory. Yeah, that's uh, that's awfully expensive, even though it landed. All right, hold what you got, bum bum. Let's just let's just chill out for a minute. Never mind, not enough time now. Shock him, shock him again. Spam the shock. Nice. Wait, was that knockout? Oh gosh. Well done, bum bum. All right, one down, six to go. It's gonna be a weird day if I if this is actually it. If if beating the S class is all that it takes to beat the game, this is gonna be friggin' weird that I did this in episode what? Eight seventeen? Eighteen? Eighteen. That's so weird. That's gonna be so weird. All the other monster inches are like fifty plus. I'm gonna have to look that up. All right, you know what? I Hold on. I'm going to just pause the video here. Give me a second. Okay, so according to an FAQ on GameFAQs.com by Bazooka Bob, there are five S-Class tournaments. One is the official, which is where we're at, and then there are four more beyond that. There is no big final match, apparently, unless Bazooka Bob was incorrect, but... There, there's apparently just the five S-Class tournaments. So I will consider the game beaten when we do all five S-Class tournaments. So, oops. So right now, we're just working on the official. Fair? D does that sound fair to everybody? Um, if there is something else... Ow! If there is something else that I need to be aware of, please let me know in the comments below uh, if there's, like, some sort of final fight or something like that. But according to... That FAQ I read, there doesn't seem to be anything else, so... Who knows, man? Alright, Bum Bum's two for two. Which is still very surprising. Those numbers, like the numbers for the monsters, are much lower in this game than any other Monster Rangers S-Classes. And between that and your monsters living longer, I can see why Monster Rancher 1 was so easy in the grand scheme of Monster Rancher games. But for those of you who are worried this will be too easy, don't worry. I, I have a plan about what we're going to be doing in future series once Monster Rancher 1 is done. Don't worry. All right, you pure Naga bastard. You're no Darth Naga. You're a pretender. Damn, that is good accuracy and power. All right, let's do this. Oof, nice dodge. Bum Bum could still use a higher, um... Could still use higher dodge rates, but... She's doing pretty okay right now. But Nagas are, by their nature, pretty inaccurate. Well, his accuracy is really high. Never mind. Ow. Get away from me. Psychic kick. Or lightning. That's fine. Critical, I'll take it. Nice dodge. Get in there. Not flame. I mean, I'll take that too, I guess, but... Damn it. He's, he's moving around just enough that I can't execute my psychic kick, what I, which is really what I... Damn it. Stop moving around so much, you freaking snake bastard. Stop it. Oh, whatever. I kicked your ass anyway. Three down. Four to go. Hot damn, Bum Bum. I wonder if the S-Class monsters are stronger in the other four tournaments, or if this is just it. Because if this is just it, then we're going to be fine. Bum Bum versus Caro, who looks like a pixie golly? Is that your subbreed? Maybe a pixie hair? Oh, loading screens. Come on, man, I'm excited. Let's see. Swayzo? Is she wearing, like, one of those protective illness masks? Those are some high numbers for a pixie. All right, let's do it. Psychic kick at 77%. That is definitely acceptable. Nice dodge. Ugh, come on, Bum Bum. Don't take too many of those. 
Hang tight. Get your willpower to 99. It looks like she's got not an eyeball, but like a sniper scope in front of her face. Critical, but that was not that much damage. She must have a lot of defense. I didn't notice. Second critical, but still not a lot of damage. Oh, slugfast. All right, switch to... All right, switch to shock. Go. We need to land some shots. Nice hit. Do it again. Spam it. One more. Come on. Nicely done. Ah, one more. Waste some time. Well done, Bum Bum. Yeah, having a very high uh, a very high accuracy, reliable attack is very useful. That is precisely why I wanted that one ready to go on my hot bar. Oh man. Four for four, three to go. So we're probably we're not gonna beat the game in this recording session, and I still am going to retire her because of how weak she is. But this means that I mean it's not gonna take that many monsters, and we will have this. Oh, that's cool. Oh, a monogali is so cool! Oh man, I gotta look up and see if I can get a PlayStation 1 disc that has a mono that's a monogali. I'll look into that as soon as we're done here. Alright. Psychic Kick is only a 50-50. Ooh, he's got some high dodge. Alright, just hang tight, Bum Bum. Let your willpower get up there. Let him waste his time just running back and forth. Ow! Hold tight. Shit. He's landing everything. Alright, we just need some more of those. He can't take more than a few of those. That's not gonna help us. I wish I could remove flame from my hotbar because it's just not useful. Oh yeah, I forgot about firewall. Ah, oh, that's weak. Don't worry about that one. Stick with psychic kick. Yeah, that's cheaper. Alright, we've got... I think we're ahead right now, but let's use some shocks, waste some time, and do some high accuracy moves. He also has no attacks from that distance. Nicely done, Bum Bum. Five for five. Oh my god. Pixies. It's always the Pixies. Holy crap. All right, you know what? Forget secrets. I'll just tell you what I'm planning because I don't know if I've mentioned this. Maybe I already mentioned it, so who cares? Um, so I've been giving it some thought, and I do remember at the beginning of the series I talked about how people hated the way I concluded the Monster Rancher 2 series. So what I have decided to do, I don't know when it's going to happen, but it will happen. I will return to Monster Rancher 2, and I'm going to resume the save from where we have it because I've still got the save and everything. But, oh my god, that is so much defense. Chuckle. Um, I will resume our save, my save, our save. And we are going to continue Monster Rancher 2, and this time, I will not cheat in order to beat the final couple tournaments. So, you know, you, the series is not complete. Monster Rancher 2 is not finaled. But first, we're going to get through Monster Rancher 1. And then I'll return to Monster Rancher 2. Whoosh! That is so freaking weak. Alright. Oh, oh. Chuckle has a chance of beating us because of... Because of that, um... Defense. Like, there's only so much I can do. And if he lands even a single shot against me, I'm gonna be in trouble. So... I mean, at this point, I'm just wearing... Oh, what am I doing? Spam! Spam him! Waste time! Waste time! Waste time! Don't let him do another attack! There we go. That's all I needed to do. Who needs a knockout? Just as long as I keep him under control. Six for six, Bum Bum! Wow! Just... Wow! Holy crap! All right... One to go against Shing, who is... Who only has one... No, he's got two losses. Oh my god, we've clinched. I think we've clinched the tournament. Unless someone else has only lost to us. 
Oh, I didn't see the table. Oh, I wish I had taken a closer look at the table. That is a golem tiger who looks a bit elongated compared to most golems. Wow. All right. Very high accuracy for a golem, I see. Or we'll stick with psychic kick since that's our Oh, that wasn't that wasn't all that strong. He doesn't have as much damage as golems usually do. Golems are usually Okos, rather than tanks. All right. Well, we've got to do some damage since he's got us kind of on the ropes at the moment. Do fire. Yeah, anything. Anything. Get away from me. All right. Just hold tight. That's what I was afraid of. Because now he's... Ah, oh, come on, Bum Bum. Get it together. Shock. Just spam it. Keep going. He's got us on our heels. We can't have this. Keep going. Again. Again. All right. He didn't have enough time for his last move. We won again. Seven for seven. Bum Bum wins in the official S-Class tournament. This is amazing. I'm stunned at how well that went. Like, are you freaking serious? Holy crap. Bum Bum goes from, I don't know if she can get, even get through the D-Class, to now she's surpassed Darth Naga. And she's a Generation 1 monster! Wow! Like, wow! Oh, man. Bum Bum, I love you. Alright, uh, congratulations on your win. You can go on to the next level. Praise him, yes. Bum Bum seems to be very happy. Oh, I can't do the Holly voice, I'm sorry. My, my voice still isn't there. I can't do the Holly voice. All right, let's see what we get. Hi, this must be it. Please sign here, please. There you go. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Here you are. <laughs> this is from Fimba. Recognition of your ability, you are now R6. Hell yeah. It's a notification. Your level is up. Good job. Now you've become one of the top breeders. I am so aroused. Bum Bum seems well. Yeah, but now it's time to retire, Bum Bum. All right, let's rest you. And then I want to see the tournament schedule. And then we'll we'll have to hit up the lab. Son of a bitch. Everything's come crashing down. Oh, God damn it. Hi, Karn. You know what? No. Just fuck off. Let me enjoy my victory without making Bum Bum do a bunch of work that she doesn't need to do. Yeah, nothing's really changed. The game is just going on. Um, oh, wait a minute. Okay, the other tournaments haven't appeared. It did say that you have to be invited into the other four, so those are probably the big four tournaments. Um... So now I'm in this awkward position where do I just let Bum Bum stay on the ranch so we can get those tournament invites? It doesn't really help me because she can't do anything unless I get invited anyway because of my rank. So I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do here. Hold on one second. I'm going to pause the video again. Sorry. Okay, I'm back. So, Bazooka Bob says that the invitation into the All-Star Cup is the first week of December. The invitation to the Masters Cup is the first week of March. The invitation to the Monsters Cup is the first week of June. And the... The Disc Cup is the first week of September. Okay, so... What is it now? It's October. Alright, so when's the next one then? The next one would be the first week of December. 
Uh, but then she'd have to last until March. Uh, or February. Oh, I don't want to do that to her because I don't know how much longer she's got. <sighs> Alright. So, I don't think that Bum Bum is going to last to February. Because that's... What is that? Six months? Five months? I don't know if she's going to make it that long. So, yeah, we're just going to have to retire her. And... We'll see if we get the invitations anyway, and go from there. And if we don't, our next S-Class monster is going to have to do it. So everybody everybody, say goodbye to Bum Bum. In the next episode, we're going to retire her, get a new monster, and continue our adventure. Thank you all very much for watching. I will see you again tomorrow for another episode. <laughs>